Hi, I'm Ken Gert, Technical Sales Engineer for Amatech. What I'm going to do today is to explain how to change brush on one of our 7.2 models. Uh, this particular one is model 115334. The first thing we want to do is make sure that the power is disconnected from the motor. The side band of the motor is held in place with one Phillips screw. You take your Phillips screwdriver and we're going to remove the side band. We're going to pull the side band back so we can have access to both brushes. Next thing we're going to do is remove the clamp that holds the brush in. There are two holes at the top of this bracket for inserting your Phillips screwdriver for removing the screws for the clamp. After the screws are removed, the clamp is removed. Now we can take the old brush, pull the brush out. You see where it's connected to the field winding. So there is a flat brass a flag terminal on the brass of the brush, and then there's a flag terminal on the motor lead uh, coming from the field. So after the, the old brush is removed, we take the new brush, we begin the process going backwards. We're going to insert the terminal onto the uh, connector. Then we're going to reposition the brush in place Reinstall the brush clamp. You want to make sure that the brush is positioned correctly, and you can tell by the way the brass is located uh, away from the commutator. Now, after both brushes are done, the process, we're going to reinstall the side band. There is a positioning tab on the back side of this motor near the lead terminals. Once that's in place, we insert the full screw and we're going to re tighten the screw and reassembling the side band. Once that's completed, we're going to run the motor in at half voltage to seat the brush uh, face. And we do that by running the motor at 60 volts or half voltage. The easiest, simplest way of taking two motors in electrical series and for about 35 minutes to 45 minutes. Though after that period, the motor is ready for use in your central vac. I'd like now to demonstrate how to change brushes on our redesigned and premier model 7.2s. This particular model is a 117-549-12. All you really need is a rather large flathead screwdriver. First thing you will want to do is make sure that the motor is disconnected from power. You can see on top of the 7.2 motor, there's two slots. This slot holds the U-shaped brush clip or clamp. So the first thing we do then is insert our screwdriver and pull that clip out. We're going to next remove the old brush. Again, the flat brass on the brass of the brush mech is inserted into the brass terminal that goes to the field. Once we remove the old brush, we now install the new brush by reversing the process. We're going to reassemble the clip uh, for the connection. We're going to insert it <clears throat> into the motor housing and reinsert the brush clip which will hold the brush in place. And then the last 
a couple millimeters of it, we will use a screwdriver to push it below the uh, fan housing. After the brushes have been replaced on both sides, you can run the motor in at half voltage for a period of 30 to 45 minutes. We recommend that uh, this be done in a number of ways, but the most simplest is using two motors running in electrical series. Please remember that when you order brushes, the brush mech that you saw uh, comes right from Lamb Electric in a kit of two.